now and what we're going to do is this is the way it should look for every day uh, cleaning and now we're going to put the jacuzzi on okay always do the suction first okay good to know then do the then do the return so they're kind of opposite each other then what about the heat the heater how do you set that or do that at the mode telling it to turn on right now, it's set for 104. Okay, that's good. That and so that, that now it's the jacuzzi is on, right? Yes. I mean the, the heat, heater, the heater, heater hasn't started. Has not started. No. Okay. It started already. Okay. I started to hear it. But I, but I can feel the heat. Yeah. All right. And if we wanted to heat the swimming pool and not just the spa, what would you do? You leave those on the regular. Okay, so like it was before, so they'd be opposite. They'd be facing opposite with the heater on and then the whole pool system would work. You know, to heat everything, mm -hmm. just leave this one in the middle. Okay. Right okay. there? Uh-huh. And you're heating spa and pool. Okay. Yeah. Alright. But this one has to be on on pool suction. Okay. That way you can be sucking the water, water through the pool. Into the spa and everything. Okay, so let's put it back to the spa. And how long should I leave it like that? that will the heater go off or? The no. heater's going to turn off? At 102. I think it's up for 104. 104 right yeah, Let's turn it down. Oh, was that 104 about right? What, what should it be set Most up for? Most people like it 102. 100, okay, turn it. Yeah, 100 sounds good actually. I don't need it real hot. I just want to warm it. 100. Okay. And then we don't need to do anything with the back. The no. Okay. All right. Great. All right. So when we're done with this.